What's up, my good people? Welcome to another Machine Quickie. How to nudge your notes. Basically, this is what I have. Right? Heard a little mistake there, right? So basically what you're going to do is you're going to visit your event section, right? Then you have your two screens that will display uh, various parameters start to end where you can actually pick your notes. And then um, you have some functions on the top here. So because we program chords for this piano sound, what we're going to do here is actually activate the chords. So we have to hit shift, then keyboard to see the screen where everything is spelled out here, all of our notes, right? So here's uh, several ways I will show you how to select notes. So like I showed you in another video, you can actually hit the, the cursor tool here and pick note by note, but that's not what we're doing. We need to correct more than one note. The easy way for me, what I usually do is I'll select all, right? And then you can see all of the notes that I selected, right? Then I will begin to manipulate the start and go all the way to the notes that I want to move over. And we're going to stop until it deselect all of the notes to the left of it. And then I'm going to begin to move my end. And it's just two, it's just two notes, as a matter of fact. And all I'm going to do here is hit nudge. Nudge, and then I'm going to move my, my toggle wheel here and just move it over a nudge. And according to the resolution that you already have set, which is pretty much here, you go to grid and you can check your, your, your settings here. Say, for instance, all of your notes are not moving according to where they need to be. All you have to do is go here to the grid window and change the resolution. You can either turn it off. Or you can, you know, just select a different resolution. A lot of times I may end up turning it off because for piano, that is, if, you, if you're trying to stay authentic to the human feel, then I would rather turn it off. And that way you can just kind of move the, the notes over however far over or, you know what I mean, with, in whichever direction and not affect the quantize or not, not quantizing it because you're trying to retain that human feel, right? But in this case... Everything seems to be uh, quantized, and I'm pretty okay with that. So I have the resolution of 1 16th, and so we cool. Let's hit nudge again, and let's move it back here. And instead of playing all the way from the top. Okay, we're going to select those four and just move it over a tad bit. And let's see what that sounds like. Let's fix the last note. It's a little bit too early. Yep. That seemed to fix the problem. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Again, my name is Ellup from ksound.com. Music is art. You are the artist. Paint your picture. <laughs>